Enemy Intel is brought to you by Rothman Institute at Jefferson, the official orthopedic and healthcare partner of the Philadelphia Eagles. What is Nick Foles going to see on Saturday night when he looks at this Atlanta Falcons defense? He's going to see a very fast defense that plays a number of basic coverages, plays them really, really well, and can get after the quarterback out of their sub packages. Now, the Falcons are very single high safety base. That's their starting point on defense. So the single high safety versions now, in man, it's cover one, in zone, it's cover three. Both have a single high safety. We'll start by taking a look at cover three. What you're going to see here is an outside throw by Jared Goff and look at the break on the ball by Desmond Trufant. So you have Trufant and Robert Alford. They're the outside corners and they're very good in this cover three scheme. But also the Falcons play man to man. So they play cover one. That's the man to man version of single high. The Rams came out with one of their staple concepts. They wanted to attack cover one. This is Alford against Cooper Cup. Cup's gonna run inside with an inside stem and try to break outside to win. Alford makes a really, really good play. So this was cover one. So what Nick Foles will see from the Falcons defense, and don't forget, we haven't even talked about their aggressive pass rush, which is very, very good, and speed at linebacker in their nickel with Devondra Campbell and with Deion Jones. But from a coverage standpoint, it's going to be single high safety coverages Cover three, which by the way, they've played a lot more of over the last three weeks. Cover one, the man version. And so this is a difficult defense to play against with its combination of concept, personnel, aggression, and speed. All right, Mike Quick with some really good cornerbacks on the Falcons and a really fast-flowing defense. Yes. I'm thinking back to last year when the Eagles ran for over 200 yards against that Falcons defense. Is that a recipe for this game here? Well, they have to run the ball and run the ball effectively against this defense. And the way you do that, John, is you take advantage of how aggressive they are. And at all levels, all three levels, they're very aggressive. And you'll see here with the motion from Zach Ertz, you'll see the effect that it has on these two linebackers. They really open the gate for the running back to get down the field. If there's a nice run lane there for the running back. So with very aggressive linebackers, quick linebackers who just go, misdirection could be the key here? Well, linebackers and also at the line of scrimmage with the big guys. So because they're so aggressive, they take advantage this time with the little trap. So they trap this three technique as he's coming up the field. And now the big guys are able to get to the second level and get blocks at the second level. But it's all about the aggressiveness of that defensive line. Watch the trap. They trap here, they get to the second level here, they get to the second level here, and it's just a great hole in allowing your running back to then get to the second level. And the Eagles have an X factor in this game. The only Eagles player to face the Falcons already this year, Jay Jai, when he was with the Dolphins in October, ran for 130 yards. That's the most the Atlanta defense has given up to a running back over the last two years. Well, and Jay is well rested and he's very familiar with this defense. And the Eagles will try with the outside zone, inside zone to get him down the field and allow him to pick his way. On that outside zone, he'll wait for daylight and then he'll turn it up the field. But that's going to be the formula in my mind. Inside zone, outside zone, allowing Jay Ajayi to get to the second level. And in the last couple games in December, he was getting 14, 15 uh, carries. Do you think he's going to get even more in this game? I think it's a game where, as I said, he's well rested and he probably will tote the load for the Eagles in the run game. <laughs>